Hi, I'm Keely, also known as Kelly. And I'm Feely, also known as Alex. Welcome to our corner of the Shire, where we will show you how to bring Middle Earth into your daily life to keep you a, a happy, happy hobbit. hobbit. Oh, hey, Feely. Hey, Keely. Oh, oh, oh sorry. Sorry, did, did I, I was, crush your... I was just oh. admiring the rosemary and all the spring blooms and being so excited for Easter. <sighs> it does smell just delightful, doesn't it? Mm. It smells what? like spring out. Yes. So anyways, what are you up to? More important things. Um, maybe um, I was hoping you could help me paint my nails. Oh, sure. I was thinking maybe for Easter and spring, it'd be fun to, you know, get some color in there. Oh, I'd love to do um, that. Kind of, you know, match, you know, all the excitement in the air, the colors. Um, yeah, so you could help me? Yeah. Okay, cool. Yeah, let's go. Thanks. Thank you so much, Keely, for doing this. I just, you know, I'm really excited about spring and it's just gonna be fun. Well, you know me, I love any art projects. Well, that's true, that's true. Very As you can painting. see, I've got all of my different colors lined up. And believe it or not, this is not product placement. I just really <laughs> like this company. Well, they're very, they're very um, Middle Earth vibes. You know, they're very natural, um, no harm. Elven? Think, yeah, even? elves would approve. They don't test on animals and their products are considered vegan. But most importantly, they keep a lot of harmful chemicals out of their stuff. For example, a lot of people don't realize that their sunscreen when they go swimming in the ocean causes death to the coral reefs because That's of the chemicals true. in it. So they avoid things like that. And this is one of their lines of nail polish that is, you know, not as bad for you. It's a favorite among the elves. Mm -hmm. We've heard that, you know, Thranduil sometimes likes putting on like a mat before a meeting, like just like a shiny kind of... Cool. But so I was thinking of like doing some pastel colors to reflect spring. I mean, um, I was more thinking of a more shiny and glittery look, maybe uh, more like dragon egg type look. Oh, that'd be cool. Yeah. Yeah. It'd be really cool. Why not? We decorate like chicken eggs. Why not? Yeah, make ex you exactly. Look like you have dragon egg nails. Exactly. So. Okay, I can do that. Okay, thanks. This is gonna be so much fun because as we all know, dragons, they produce eggs that look like variations of their colors. You know, yep, like yep. Their scales and stuff. I know all about that. I, I, I look at a lot of photos of dragon eggs around this time of year. Dragon gram, you fall yeah. dragons on dragon gram. Yeah. So I'm just shaking up. I shook all these earlier and I'm shaking them up again because you just want to make sure it's well mixed. So here we go. I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna experiment. This one's called minty bikini. Okay, okay. Let's try some minty bikini. As you can see, this is a very um, beautiful table. It's very wobbly. Very wobbly, very, very chipped. And if this is HD enough, you'll be able to see <laughs> wrinkles and dry cracks in my hands. We all have that feeling. <laughs> oh, hey, that's yes. nice. This is pink metal. So my, I'm, I'm going to do a different style dragon egg for each finger. Okay, so are you thinking of like... <sighs> I don't know, how are you going to go with your design? Is this, is this coming to free flow? style or are you planning pretty, pretty much free flow okay um, okay is that generally how you do your your nail work here at keely salon it is and as you can see we're not always 
Oh, that's okay. You can. Are you kidding me? A little. That's better fact, than I could do. A little known fact is that when you get it on your skin, you can actually peel it off later. That's true, and we don't um, have our nails painted very often, so. This is a big deal. Yeah, it's a big deal, and um, yeah, my nails kind of look like Frodo's. They're a little dirty and small, but that's okay. That's because you use them. That's true. So one thing that's a good idea is to kind of wipe the excess off before you put it on so you don't end up with a massive globule like I did there. Yeah, what are some tips for if you want to do dragon eggs at home? Well, just remember to let it dry. Like, I'm letting these layers dry. Okay. And that if you put it on thin, it's going to dry faster. And if it's not the color you want yet, just let it dry and then you can do another coat. I used to rush my nail polish back when I used to do it. I used to love to paint rainbow nails when I was in, like, middle school. Yeah, that's awesome. And... I would often rush it to the point that I would put on the second or third coat before the first one was dry. And then they just peel off, like it gets all chunky and weird. I always just do one really sloppy thick coat and call it a day. Doesn't usually work out well though. <laughs> <laughs> What's nice about- oh, Look at that! This nail polish, is Oof. It, dries, it dries fairly quickly. And it's not nearly as repulsively stinky which is quite nice. So for your thumb, I'm gonna do opal. Okay, oh, let me okay. tell you what the colors were. Yeah. That, that, this is tourmaline. Okay. This is afterglow. Okay. And that was ocean princess. Very nice. This is opal. A favorite in our family, especially among Mama Deese, is unicorn horn, which is this one. Ooh. It's got an opalescent. Very nice, very nice. I think, I, I kind of think Arwen might use that one sometimes. Oh wait, so this is oh, hard. Did, like, did I already I mess have, it up? No, I have to rotate your thumb while somehow not dragging your fingers on the... You know, maybe the next one we can Whoa. try to angle so you guys can see this happening live time. Opal looks... Oh, that's that pretty. bioluminescent. That is neat. Now, a lot of these colors and... and um, but their textures or whatever you'd call it are nice and shiny. They're dramatic. You know, they're very um, dragon egg. They stand out. Now, I don't know if these are all still available because I know a lot of these didn't you get on sales, so they might not these were produce on sale the colors. Because they've released a new type. This is seven free. Now there's like five free, so they have even fewer oh. chemicals. But you have to just, you know, work within your budget. Oh, yeah. So. We're and using this for right now. Yeah, they're really nice. And what I like about this nail polish too is I've always had it come off really easy with nail polish remover. And you know, this is an activity fit for, you know, any species in Middle Earth, any gender, you know. I've heard the dwarves can get really into black nail polish when they blast metal down in the mines. So for your pointer finger on that hand, yeah. that one's getting <gasps> gold lame. Oh. Very nice. Actually, never mind. It's not. That it's not. It says it's, it's a top actually coat. not. It's so, a top coat. <gasps> what just happened? Okay, just moon messed ray. it up. Instead, you're gonna get. Moon Dude, ray. this almost looks like I would almost call this like that was blue topaz. I think. Like, what am I trying to say here? To me, it looks like moonlight and bio yeah. It, well, I guess what I'm trying to say is it reminds me of the door down. in Moria when it glowed. Oh yeah. Like it kind of reminds me of that feeling and that color. These ones are a little more light. I'm not. I'm now not there's probably them. a lot of um, things that you could do to prep your nails for something yeah, like this. Like base coats people stuff. probably yeah do base coats, maybe wash them. Um, Things like that, Your hands are clean enough. but yeah, you can just you know whip them out and and go and just start painting. And that's fine too. Just, just hold it flat. Hold it flat. Oh yeah, just trying to show show the, the folks there at home. No, it's the problem my hand. But that one looks like old Greg's skin. If anyone watching this knows who old Greg is, you'll know what I'm talking about. Wow, it's definitely. I thought it'd be that's more. That's abalone. Oh. It does kind of look like okay. that. Okay. That's nice. That is pretty. 
It's a little bit faint. A lot of these actually, well, these are more solid, I guess. I was gonna say, these ones look more, um, a little bit more opaque. I'm glad you're open to me experimenting because yeah, that's what I love about dyeing Easter eggs and stuff is just that's true. Having fun. I know. I mean, Easter egg dyeing, decorating, Oops. Easter spring cookies and art projects is always fun. I'm trying to take a little off this one okay, so that it okay. actually dries in the All century. Right, okay. Now there's probably a lot of you at home watching this and cringing, but that's, what that's all right. A happy Hobbit great. It does. Saying, wait, you should use a this, but that's okay. Why are you doing that? Wait, did I use this one yet? I like how did I keep I... showing you this hand and you've seen it like 17 times by now. Wait, where's my favorite one? <gasps> this this one? one, Before Dusk. Oh, this one's really pretty. That's the- Is that the old Greg? Yeah, that's um, abalone. Okay, let me do Before Dusk on your pinky. Okay. <sighs> this is so much more exciting than just normal nails. I know. I mean, everyone else in Middle Earth just does like one color or just something more boring, but why not go Dragon Egg? I mean, it's really cool. Okay. So I'm going to see if your first hand is done. Okay. Okay. Check those talons. How do we check the talon? Do we tap? Let's see. Tap the talon? Yeah, but then sometimes you leave a fingerprint. That's very true. <gasps> Oh, that's oh. fully dry. Oh. Oh. Okay, I call those dry. We are in, folks. So, okay. This For is this... looking good. I That purple, honestly, look at that. Okay, minty bikini. This one. Yeah, that one's it's... Me metal pink or something. I mean, gosh, if you're dragon egg and you were a mother dragon, and that was the color of your egg, wow. Minty bikini is getting unicorn horn on top. Is that a Urukai favorite? The, the minty, minty bikini? Uh, mint green bikinis are. They love to wear them, but I don't know if that color is. Okay, I, well, because of you I know, know the outfit choice, you, I thought, I but, got confused, they, but they probably wouldn't. They don't want to be that obvious. <gasps> oh, oh dear. Oh, I just there was a casualty. There was a casualty, <laughs> <laughs> ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> Help me! <laughs> I'm a little pinky. Baby. Okay, wait, give me your pinky. Fix him. Good thing I'm not paying you for this. Gosh. Paid me in my life. Unfortunately, unicorn horn isn't showing up. This unicorn horn is a more subtle one. It's on this. Oh. It's a more subtle one, and you can see it more in the light as you rotate it. Put your hand back down. I like how there's paint sticking to. Oh yeah, the paint on this table um, will get stuck to anything it touches. Okay, so. So yeah, this is this is so fun. I mean, painting nails this is, is really creative. Now, you can I, go wild. I don't know what I'm doing right now. That's so what I want to do is make some polka dots. So I'm gonna try to just I'm gonna try first. Ow, <gasps> man's biting my foot. Ew, jerk. You can um yeah. I'm gonna try to just gently. So I don't really know what I'm doing right now. I'm trying to make. Oh. Hey, is... that actually kind of looks like a. Can't quite see it on the cam. I'll show you in a moment. That's that's cool. That's why it's cool to do it to someone else. Whoa! Look at that. That's really cool. That looks like a baby dragon. Sometimes they have spots, you know. And well, now I'm gonna do the pink, the pointer finger. These are really nice. Actually, I'm gonna do. I know you really like that purple, so I'm gonna leave most of the purple. Okay. 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 Hold still. Whoa! Not quite as tidy Whoa. as I'd hoped. But you can pick off the excess. I could use the Q-tip to try to clean it up, but then... I think that helped. And then the stuff in the gutter. <laughs> You'll pick that off. Yeah, in the gutter. This is looking nice. Yeah. So... Next, I want to do this one. I might try using... I might just try getting a bunch of it. Off. And look, don't feel guilty if you just have plain old normal, not like vegan <laughs> nail polish. That's just fine. No, but if as long were... as you clean it off at some point. 
If you were looking just to switch, I've switched all my makeup and everything to this company because it really helps my skin. Um, they have beneficial stuff rather than harmful stuff in it, and I like that it's more in line with my Middle Earthian values. That one! Ooh! That's like a tiger drink. That's really nice. That's really nice. That's quite nice. So, let's see if this one. Yeah, they're dry. He's dry? This okay. lip polish does dry fairly quickly. Yeah, it seems like it's very fast. I want to use pink again on that one, I think, because I'm still kind of going spring colors. I like that this one kind of looks like a milkshake. Which one? The blue, I mean the purple and pink. Yeah, it's like very strawberry milkshake, kind of like your soap. Okay, let me see that thumb. Oh yes, maybe, maybe on camera, we'll see. I'm gonna try to do some dots. Here, I'll stabilize it. Okay, just trying to. Yeah, just relax. Ooh. See, if you get a lot of the nail polish off, you actually can have some finesse. And if you try to do this to yourself, I wish you luck. It's really hard to even just paint nails by yourself. Yeah, it's fine, you know, go for it, but don't feel bad if it's sloppy. Well, my, the hand I paint, because I'm right hand dominant, with my left hand always turns out funky. Yeah, it's, it's very difficult. And then if you're like me, I forget that I've done this within like five minutes and then I just smear them on everything. <laughs> okay, so put them flat. Blue topaz. Mm, is going to go I on like top that. That's, That's nice. Dude, these are really turning out nice. I'm going to attempt a stripe, I think. Okay. For some reason, those horizontal stripes are harder for me. Yeah, they are hard. Well, it's a very thick brush as well. You know, it's hard to hold it at the right angle. Ooh. That's okay. A little bit of a sky feeling there. Now we need something. Right to pop. How about afterglow? The orange Ooh. one I got, especially for Feely, because orange Very is Very nice. Color. I would like to try to do a zigzag. Ooh. That might be overly ambitious, but I'll, I'll still try. I'm going to do a lightning bolt. Okay. Harry Potter it is. Ooh, that's turning out. It looks like a lightning bolt. If yeah, you know what it is, it that's does. cool. It looks like a rune or something. Kind of does. Actually. That's neat. Ooh, I that like it. That would be cool to do rune, Middle Earth runes. Yeah, I mean, look, we could try to symbols. get better and do that as another episode. Okay, I'm psyched about this one. This is Gold Lame Crystal Gloss Top Coat. Ooh. I'm putting that on your Pastelli whoa, Welly. Whoa, whoa, Pastelli Welly going. Oh my god. I know. That's this beautiful. Smaug would go nuts for this. Yes. This is like really gold. Oh, it's like rainbow gold. <gasps> wow. That's my favorite combination so far. I am yeah. a sucker for sparkles. That's really nice. Oh, yeah. Oh, wow. That's really nice. Sorry, I had to see it before you got to. Well, it's your hand. I guess. I'm gonna attempt. I don't see my body though on the camera, so I don't really know. Do really this know could be anyone's hands. That's true. This could be. And this could all be a voiceover. Yep. That's you know. I could be someone secret getting my nails okay, so done. Here, I'm doing moon ray, attempting the same effect. I don't know if it will be as. Oh. Oh wow, that's pretty. That in itself is like. So here's what I'm thinking. Yeah. That looks nice. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. I might. That looks really nice. Add a little bit of this gold lame to everything. Once okay. It's dry. Why not? So let's give it a second to dry. Okay. And then I'm gonna add that just for some extra dragon pizzazz, and then you'll really look like you've dragon egg nails. Yeah, that's true. That'll be really nice. So. I'm going to see what it looks like putting this dragon gold on top of everything. Just like a little bit. Ooh, that came out too much, but you know, you can fix that later. Yeah. Ooh, yeah. Ooh. That adds some pizzazz. Ooh. Sparkle. Try to get some. You just never have enough sparkle. No. It's 
just a little bit of smaug in all of us. And this is really Ooh. because dragons are really proud of when little flecks of gold appear on their eggs. Oh, I forgot your thumb on that hand. Oh. <gasps> They're left out. It's so plain Jane. Yeah, look at. Oh, I've got, I can't just leave it like that. Mm -mm. Um, I think I shall try to do, I'm gonna do, Ooh. I'm gonna try to do a flower. Okay. How should I? Okay. Yeah, if you hold it flat. <gasps> I can't see it. Okay, it's not a very good flower, but I gasped because nail polish fell. So if you put your thumb down, you're gonna put it in. Okay, I see it, I see it. Little purple flower right there, ready for spring. I'm a better artist than this. Oh. I mean, these are nicer than I could ever it's do. It's just hard with these brushes. Okay, oh, let me give the flower hard. a center. Oh, yeah. Now it has a center. You want to show them that? Look at that. Oh, sorry. Let it dry. And while that dries, I will continue with my gold lame. This thumb. That, see, that looks pretty on the Yeah. Thumb. But now. Oh, it's gonna go up a notch, that's for sure. Now, I don't wanna coat, like, I don't wanna hide the original colors. I'm just. Oh my enhancing. gosh, this one is the best in the world. Isn't Which one it? Is this? Gold Lame top coat. Wow, this. Oh, wow. That's really nice. I mean, I could add extra to that one, but I already did it. Hey, that's all right. I'm just gonna add a teeny bit to this okay. one, because this one already has some spots. Yeah. That looks pretty good. Now, that sure does. Let me see if that one dried. Okay. The, I imagine the center looked a little, oh. I just put a thing. That's thing okay. There, it's all right. It's now I'll bring it to the police with your together. crime scene. Oh, that's nice. That's nice. That's that's really nice. It's almost like a spring card in in a fingernail. Show them your nails. Look at that. Look at that, ladies and gentlemen. Job. And wow, those are really nice. You did a really good job, Keely. Thank you. Well, this turned out really nice. I don't know about you, but I'm actually fairly happy with it. Yeah, I think they look great. And in fact, this is a great way to, you know, if you're getting together with family and friends on on a video call for the season. Yeah, you could just um, hold them up. You can show them off. Yeah, you, hold them up you could even camera. do this on a video call That's with true. someone. They could even help you design. You know? Yeah, the other person could be saying, now try this, It could be your spring that. activity with someone, like it, like it is right now. Yeah, that's true. This is perfect. It's a great idea for it. It looks, the dragon eggs just look phenomenal, Keely. I'm, I think they could really rival, um, I, uh, just, they just look great. They look great. Rival what? Oh, nothing. Just, um, oh, they, they, they just look so much like real dragon eggs that I, I think they could rival real dragon eggs. If I wanted to. What? Where? Um, oh, nowhere. Just somewhere where a bunch of dragons might be getting together and showing off their eggs. Feely! At springtime and You can't admiring. go to that contest! I can go to Hatchfest if I want to. I've always wanted to go. You Hatch can't stop me! Hatchfest is only for fire drakes. You can't stop me! Feely, you can't do that. They'll kill you. I can't believe she just took off the dragon hatch contest. I don't even remember the name. It changes all the time because we don't speak dragon. It's very exclusive, fire drakes only, and it's their annual gathering where they come to show off all the eggs that they've laid and are incubating, and, and they're just supposed to be jewels to behold. Everyone on Middle Earth wants to see it, but we can't just barge in like that. I don't know. 
Oh, this has been quite the long journey, but I am almost at the location of the gathering. I've had to conceal myself several times from those pesky denizens that walk on two legs at... What the... What the... What are you doing here? No! This is not a place for outsiders. Feely! Wait, what's that? Feely? I barely made it with my life. I um decided it um it might be better to celebrate it from here. The dragons were a little bit bigger and scarier than I I, I thought they might be, so we can just celebrate dragon eggs and Easter and all that fun stuff home, I guess. I think that's a good idea. Well, from Keely and, and Feely. Or from Keely. And Feely. We wish you a, a happy, happy Easter. Easter. A happy hobbity Easter. Yes, mm -hmm. very nice. No one followed you, did they? I mean, I don't think so. <laughs> I think that was good. Yeah. Your nails should be dry. I know, that's true. It's really hard once you feel the stuff on them. I know, to not I feel like I like... can't do anything. I know. Come after the dragon scream. Oh, we should film us saying Happy Easter. Oh, yeah. Beauties. They are worthy of dragon <laughs> let's, let's say it with him. Okay. okay. On. What's, I don't know what's gonna happen to her. They could eat her. Is that, was that okay? Yeah, that was perfect. Wait, she's right here. He's really big! She was right here looking at her nails. It's a lot bigger than you think he is. <laughs> That's what they all say. <laughs> Good thing Rosemary's tough. <gasps> oh my gosh! My goldfish! I know! <laughs> hey, Missy will like it. Hey, perfect timing. Okay, we've got first shot. Yeah. I should you come scream and say hello. Okay. So wait, wait. You put your mind out okay. and you're like, thanks so much okay. for doing this. Are you the camera? Yeah. Okay. They're goldfish. I don't see any fishy crackers on your face. It's possible, no. Okay. All right. <clears throat> wait, okay. Thank you so much for doing this, Keely. I really appreciate it. You're welcome. As you can see, I've got all the different colors lined up. Just to eat them first. You found fishy crackers. Yummy goldfish, Missy. Shoot, I'm gonna take a picture of you guys. Let me get them. Good job, Mischief. Thank you for cleaning up. Thank you, Pumpkin. Thank Hi, you, darling. Pumpkin. I love you. Thank you, Pumpkin. We've heard that, you know, Thranda Will sometimes likes putting on like a mat before a meeting, like just like a shiny kind of Yeah, but I've heard he's clear. like not so into being eco-friendly. Oh, really? Yeah, that's the rumor oh. I heard coming out of Mirkwood. Oh, so maybe it's more like a facade he puts on. I think it is. Okay, interesting. I know, it's upsetting. It is. Well, I mean, I guess that makes sense why I saw leg loss shopping and his cart wasn't of the best stuff. I think he's going through a rough time. Since that RV and the spider yeah. webs. And that was it's a few years ago. So, he, but, but to him, that's not like long. Tell yeah, that's, like, Whoa, that's true. Like that's true. That's true. So he might not have even vacuumed in I know. five years. So. Struggle. <laughs>
<laughs> okay. This beautiful chipped paint is really nice backdrop. Oh yeah, you painted this. Thing. Yeah, it came off. <laughs> okay. Well, well all right, recording. all right. Okay, okay. Um. So. <laughs> this is why you don't get much happy hop anymore. <laughs> Everything in the world conspires against us every time we try to film. It shouldn't be too bad. Okay. okay. All right. All right, I'm so excited to be at the Keeley Salon. Like that was kind of <laughs> And then maybe, do you want to just pull your chair over so you don't have to hunch? Oh no, and... it's okay. It might be easier for me. But to how are you like going to be like hunching over like Notre Dame? I'm used to horrible things. Okay, but well, you can just sit. Try. Thank you.